And students from across the southeast were at Lake Lurleen today testing their engineering skills. WVUA 23's Taylor Mooney joins us live now with more. Taylor. Jabari, civil engineering students in colleges from Alabama, Florida, Georgia, and Tennessee were set to compete in a rather different competition. That competition? Building a concrete canoe. The American Society of Civil Engineers holds a three-day competition culminating with a concrete canoe race. Alabama fans are familiar with the process, and that's exactly what the competition is. Canoes, the rules come out sometime between uh, August, September, October, in that range. Uh, normally the boats are poured sometime between December and February, and then they go and uh, it takes 28 days to cure typically. Um, this concrete's pretty typical to cure in 28 days, but some are faster. Creating the canoes takes months, and for students at the University of Puerto Rico, they have even less time. They have to ship their canoe by boat two weeks prior in order to be on time, but it's a challenge that they're embracing. So we have to be really early finishing on our project in order to make it on time here. So it's a huge challenge, but as a team, we address the best build possible, best positive vibes, and we are here, so it all worth it. The students are scored in four different categories. They write an essay and present their product. They also have an aesthetic portion of the grade and finally the race. There were over 800 students who entered the contest. The winner of this year's canoe race was the University of Florida and the overall winner was the University of Puerto Rico. Reporting live, Taylor Mooney, WVUA 23 News.